Dwayne here, phoenixtypewriter.com. Got the Royal Quiet Deluxe from, I don't know, the early 50s maybe. I think we, we looked this up, I think it was 1953. It's got the pop-up lid. Nice little machine. We were done cleaning it, servicing it, everything was fine. And I was typing on it, doing kind of a final test. And all of a sudden, the ribbon stopped moving. It's working now. So I investigated. And I found a very worn out part in here. Let me move these type bars up. We're going to see if we can see this on camera. It's pretty, pretty buried in here. Move a couple more bars up out of the way. Okay, we got a little ratchet assembly here with a mechanism that pushes the ratchet forward like that. And then there's a backup one so it doesn't let it back up. So this one pushes a little bit. That mechanism's down here. Get a light and something to show where that's at. Okay, you can barely see it here. So there's two dots right there, right there. And if you look real carefully, you can see it's actually worn off. There's two grooves. One is for one direction, and then it moves with the ribbon reverse arm here to that. And w where it was engaging on that little gear right there. With, uh, see the gear? You can see the, the gear here, right there. Where it was engaging on this piece, it fl slips up like that. You can see those, there's a groove cut in here. There's a slight groove there and a deeper groove there. And that's where it was slipping. It wasn't driving. So when it moves, it wasn't wasn't moving that ratchet enough. I don't think it was moving it at all. So what I there's a couple things. That's a that's kind of a common drive system. What you need to do is position it so it's on some fresh material. So this arm was pretty much unmovable even though it flops around a little loose. It wasn't anything you could really form or bend. So I took a look underneath, and sure enough, the ratchet under here is right here. And this has a set screw in it. Let's see if I can get this turned. So this has a set screw right there. There's a set screw. What I ended up doing, and it worked, was loosening that set screw and just ever so slightly moving this whole gear, ratchet gear, over that way a little bit. I think I could have gone that way too, but I went ahead and went that way. About, just about the distance of the width of this gear right here. So, what that ended up doing was making a different contact point on that drive mechanism. So now it's got fresh material. Now I suppose the surefire fix would be to get in here somehow and replace that piece which looks kind of difficult. But that worked and it's, it tests out just fine. So when it goes back and forth it, it gets a new spot. By the way these are already bent like this. This is the design of it, so I did not bend these, even though they look a little more bent than they should be, but they were that way. I'm going to leave them, everything's working fine. So that is the ribbon drive adjustment repair modification for a Quiet Deluxe that's not driving the ribbon, or at least that little ratchet assembly is not working properly so that's our video of the day phoenix tap have a good day